Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this physics game is called the Leaning Tower. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to roll this little multicolored dice. Every time we roll it, we're going to remove one of the colored pillars. The goal when you're playing with somebody else is to not be the person who knocks it over when you roll the dice and pull the pillars. But this demonstrates Newton's first three laws of motion, or his only three laws of motion, quite well. Let's see if we can identify all of the ways that this demonstrates Newton's laws of motion. So I'm going to roll it really good. Okay, so we've got a red. Now, <clears throat> obviously it demonstrates Newton's first law of motion, which states an object at rest will stay at rest. The whole thing is just staying there, and until I act upon it, that's exactly the same way it's going to remain. So I'm going to look for a red that I can remove. There's one right there. Hey, until acted upon by an outside unbalanced force. Well, my fingers were the unbalanced force, and I just acted upon them. So I'm going to roll again. Hey, purple this time. Objects at rest, stay at rest. Until acted upon by an outside unbalanced force. Sure enough, works just fine. Green this time. Hmm. Oh, there's one right there. Ha, ha, ha. Look at that, I'm getting good at this game. Now, does it also demonstrate Newton's second law of motion? It takes a force to accelerate a mass. Well, in order for one of these things to move, they go from non-moving to moving, that's an acceleration. It's going to require my force, and the force of my muscular force acting on it definitely is going to be necessary. So, that's what's going on. Now, there's actually forces acting on this anyway. Remember, since it's sitting still and it's on a solid surface, it has the normal force acting on it, has normal force acting on it, and as a result, it also has gravity. And actually, believe it or not, the gravitational force is getting slightly weaker overall in the tower because its weight is going down. Every time I remove a pillar, its weight decreases. However, it also weakens the normal force because that's going vertically through all of the different pieces. Blue one, I saw one right here. Whew. Almost bumped it too much. <clears throat> Red one. I'm not sure that one's ready to go. Got that one. Absolutely doing pretty well overall. Ooh, two red ones in a row. That's scary. Let's see what I got. That one back here. Rolling pretty well. So it has Newton's first law of motion. Objects at rest stay at rest until acted upon. It has Newton's second law. Force is required to accelerate a mass. But does it have Newton's third law? Well, actually, that's where it gets kind of tricky. But yes, it absolutely does. It's obvious that just by pulling on some of these pieces, I can feel them. So obviously they're pushing back. Their inertia is pushing against me. So for my force pushing on them, they push back in resistance. But watch carefully as the video plays. You'll see the whole tower sway or resist its inertia. As I pull against it and sometimes, you'll see the whole thing start to sway. Those are the two forces resisting. It's inertia and the normal forces and friction fighting against my forces, and you actually see them start to push against each other as we play. Green one. That one looks like it's going to come back here. So that's Newton's third law. And so if you've been assigned this game, it's going to be your challenge to demonstrate. I'm running out of reds. If I take that one off, I think I'll lose. Ooh, that one will work. Ooh, did you see it fight back there? <laughs> it even settled a little bit. Oh, I think I'm about to lose. Ooh, purple. Okay, I think I got a purple right here. Doing pretty well. So, Newton's first law, Newton's second law, Newton's third law. Your job is to write this up, do a demo, a diagram showing all of the forces in action. Okay, holding it in place and explain how Newton's law acts on each. And so Newton's third law is the trickiest one because it's how the friction is being fought 
is fighting against my muscular force. You can see it tip every once in a while or start to sway against me. Jeez, two oranges in a row. It's going to kill me here. Oh, here we go. Yeah, that's the one. I think I'm about to lose here. And then we'll be able to see Newton's first law in action again. Objects in motion stay in motion. You'll see even the top section fall all at once at the same time as everything else falls. The only thing that's going to stop them from falling is when they hit the table and spread out everywhere. And hopefully I'll find all the pieces. Oh, blue. Uh, I think this might move oh, this one. Got it. Woo! Mr. Skinner, you're just too good at this game for little four-year-olds. Oh, orange. Okay. I think this might be my only move right here. Watch it fighting me as I push against it. Yeah, there's no way that one's going to come. Ah! Physics in the Leaning Tower.